All right, today um, we had a very successful day. We got our intake prototype mounted to our upper arm. It, uh, it sits out right about here. It takes the, the cubes and it'll hold back and lift all the way up to the corner. Um, the next step is to mount these dart actuators. We'll have one on either side. Right about here. Once we get those mounted, we'll have full motion. Uh, it'll take the 12 inch stroke of the dart actuator to a 7 foot stroke on the end of our arm. All right, and so for the wrist, we're going to use an Annie Mark red line with a VEX 25 to 1 gearbox to make a twist up and down to give us that full range of motion. We've also got our motors on uh, bungees. So when we go to suck anything up, it doesn't matter how it comes in, it'll always wrap around it and just bring it in. Hey everyone, this is Patrick. Uh, I've been putting together the CAD model over the last couple days of our robot and I'm here to kind of go over it with you and show you what we've got so far. So uh, from this picture you can see the mostly completed robot with the arm actuated in the upright position. Uh, the arm is controlled with a couple of linear actuators from Animark. Uh, you can see how they're mounted here. They pivot at the bottom and they're connected with rod ends at the top. Uh, the box in the upright position is, uh, you, as you can see from the picture, about six feet off the ground. So it should be uh, easy to place on the scale, uh, even in the highest position from the scale. Uh, so that shouldn't be an issue for us, uh, but it's flexible if we need it to be. Uh, this uh, image is in response to uh, Dan from a YouTube comment uh, on our first day one update. Shout out to Dan. Uh, he asked a question about the frame perimeter rules uh, and how uh, far you can extend over the perimeter. Uh, this is showing if your bot is 33 inches long, which is the max, uh, you can extend 16 inches beyond that, uh, which we are just barely in. We're about a quarter of an inch in, so it can be done. Just uh, measure twice and cut once kind of thing. And this is just an image to show how the box is procured by our uh, box intake system. 